Hey guys, happy Tuesday. And we're gonna be doing some push press today, some overhead work. Um, this will be some higher volume, lower weight, but working on good position here. Remember, this is week one of our new cycle, so we're gonna be building on this. Uh, but we're gonna come out of the rack, not a full front rack. I think the elbows are about 45 degrees, but this weight is still sitting on the shoulders. Okay, so take some time, try to get as much of a grip on it as you can, but still feel the weight sitting on the shoulders. Okay, feet should be right under the hips. Not, not too wide, right under the hips, okay? We're dipping straight down, driving up, good lock out at the top, good neutral spine, you don't want to be looking up like this, right, good, good strong lock out. As you wrap these together, try to catch it in the beginning of your next rep, okay? And then try to avoid re-bending the knees. If you see what I just did there, if it gets heavy, people start doing what's called a jerk, okay? So really, as it gets heavy, you get tired, you're really gonna feel that press at the top, okay? Um, so we'll be doing three sets of 10 here. Again, good position, good straight dip and drive, neutral spine, okay? From here, we're going into a classic uh, crossfit workout, some classic moves here. Uh, we'll be doing some cows on the bike. Burpee box jump over, so burpee box jump over, do a bur burpee on one side, and then two footed jump over to the other side. You can jump forward, you can jump laterally, as long as you get down to the floor on one side, two foot a jump over to the other side. We're also gonna be adding in some double unders to this. So, double unders focus on nice and wide shoulders, focusing on the wrist, driving the rope. Okay, here's my chest is upright. I'm able to talk and breathe. My wrists are driving the rope, okay? If you're just learning, Try to put some singles in between. So always keep the chest up. You can tuck your feet a little bit, that's okay. All right, if that's hard for you, uh, you're not kicking doubles at all. We tell people to start with like a heavy, one of the heavy ropes, singles, just to get some training with a heavier rope. Um, here, last thing for this workout, is gonna be alternating V-ups. So, laying on your back, arms overhead. You're gonna sit up, put your right hand to your opposite foot. Okay. And that will be our AMRAP of movements that we're working through. Okay, so the finisher today, most of the time we don't go over the finisher movements, but there is one that we don't see very often called Philly Press that I want to review. So the Philly Press is a seated position, so press overhead. You're going to hold one um, in position in the rack, and then the other one is going to be pressing overhead. Okay, you're going to do one arm first for 10 reps, the other arm. Okay, so that is the Philly Press in the finisher, guys. See you tomorrow.